what is an offer? When you put your home for sale on the market, you are essentially making an offer to buyers. They can acquire the house for a given price and other terms. The process of making offers varies around the country. Usually, the buyer's agent will submit a written proposal to the seller through the seller's agent. During the negotiation cycle, each party can respond with several options. Accept the offer, decline the offer, make a counter offer. What is a counter offer? A counter offer is nothing more than the same offer with different terms. Offers and counter offers reflect the back and forth activity in the negotiating process. Also, it may contain tricky clauses and hidden costs. Because counter offers are common, buyers need to stay in touch with their agent during the negotiation process. The negotiation cycle is a common, efficient and practical way to reach an agreement. What is an acceptable offer? Every seller wants to have a line of buyers at their front door bringing higher and higher bids. And while this is not unusual in a hot market, there is some balance between the number of sellers and buyers in most markets. You have received an offer on your home. Now what? Also, if several bids are received, do you choose the fantastic offer from the purchaser who needs a mortgage pre-approved or a lesser offer from a buyer with already pre-approved financing? What are the conditions and what time period buyers offer? And, those, and can those conditions and time frame be changed to your benefit? If there is a better deal than the buyer's offer, do you have enough time to wait for other offers? What if no better offer is received? In each case, the seller will need to carefully review offers, consider marketplace options, and determine whether the sale request suits them. Conditions and subject to clauses. The buyer's offer often contains conditions or subject to clauses that must be reached before the proposal becomes firm and binding. The most common conditions are financing, satisfactory home inspection, test results for environmental factors including oil tanks, soil, mold, and water quality, easements, liens, buyer's lawyer review. Every negotiation must reach an agreement that suits both parties. In real estate closings, it means the price, closing date, and conditions worked well for both parties. With proper direction and sound advice, you will get excellent results. As always, good luck with your plans. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.